With all the hype around the S8 and S8 Plus launch, like many of you interested in buying this phone, I decided to go and check out the phones for myself in my nearest Samsung Experience store and these are my first hands-on impressions. First of all, I think this phone looks absolutely gorgeous. The screen to body ratio is absolutely amazing and I definitely feel like this is the phone to get if you want to look futuristic in 2017. With that being said, I realized that this device is very very tall. Even the S8 that's being shown over here is very tall and it's very difficult to reach end to end of this phone with a single hand. So it's definitely not a single handed device for most people. And the rounded edges of the phone and with the symmetrical design makes the phone very slippery. So I'm expecting a case would be an essential part of this phone not just to protect it but also to get a better grip. And just look at the back of the phone over here. This display unit is a definite smudge magnet. It looks disgustingly smudgy. But for me, the most essential feature that I think is missing is the double tap the home button to launch the camera. I started loving that feature in my S7 and I'm very disappointed to see that with the absence of the physical home button, there's no way of getting that around. We all know that the S8 and S8 Plus is gonna have a great camera because it's essentially the same camera as the Galaxy S7 which was really really good. And if you're like me and need quick access to your camera, you're definitely gonna miss the double tap the home button to launch the camera feature. There are reports to show that you can possibly replicate that feature using the power button but the power button is just not gonna be as easy and convenient to reach. So the S8 is definitely having some shortcomings in that respect. The double tap to home button is a feature that I'm gonna miss. In S7 it was fast, reliable and definitely responsive. So that was my quick hands-on impressions of the S8 and S8 Plus. If you found this video useful, do support the channel, I really appreciate it. And see you in the next one.